congratulations. I mean, we are so excited to see you knock this out of the park. What does it mean to you to play the first lesbian superhero? Uh, every, I mean, everything. It's amazing. Going into it, I was excited because superhero. Yeah. I was excited because Batwoman. Yeah. I also love bats. You know, there was like lots of, and then it's LGBTQ, and and then there's Caroline Drys, there's CW, there's DC, there's Greg Valanti. There's a lot of reasons as an actor going into it as a role to be excited. Um, then the casting choices and, and knowing who it was going to be, and that was all very exciting. But nothing really hit home until, I mean, and the suit was very exciting, and I got that for the crossover. But even at the crossover, like I kind of joke and say, like I didn't really know what I was doing when I now compare it to Batwoman the show because I didn't have a script, so I didn't have a pilot with a backstory and who she was, and all I had was some comics that I knew we would draw from, but also there's many, many comics spanning many decades. So it was interesting, but it was very fun. But when we go into Batwoman the series, it's just really real, and it's grounded, and Kate uh, goes through a lot, so it was kind of emotionally exhausting and then it's emotionally rewarding as there's these triumphs over things that people go through on the daily and I feel like we're telling a very accurate representation of people now and people for many many times and generations but I love the fact that people can tune in and see whether it's Kate Kane whether it's you know Sophie whether it's any of the characters we have a very diverse cast a very diverse story and it's just I don't know it's it, it feels very special and I don't often say, like, I don't just sort of say that about anything I'm doing. It's like, that's a hard thing to say because then you put yourself in a vulnerable position for people to say. We're telling you, it's special. Yeah, it, it, it felt special. Um, doing the pilot brought up a lot of things because we wanted to, you know, we have to work out how, who Kate is and where she came from and what she's doing and what her direction is and what is her purpose kind of thing. And, and you're discovering that as, that as she is. And so I'm discovering it as she is. And... It is very empowering to play that role. Absolutely. How physically demanding is the role? Are you kicking a lot of ass? I mean, like, we know you yeah. in that suit. In that suit. I am, there is some ass kicking to be done, but I think, and I mean, obviously that's what everyone loves and knows and expects and will definitely be a huge component of Batwoman. But it's also about establishing why. You know, it's like, it's all very well to go around and kick ass, but if there's not really any purpose or reason or heart behind it, it's sort of it's just action. Um, so I think there's a lot of that first, so it gives it higher stakes and it gives you more of an investment to like what side or what character or who or why and is that the right decision to make and is it the wrong decision to make and I think that's why it's more like intellectually it's challenging and I like that. Um, but yeah, there's some stunts, it was maybe the most, probably the most tricky, like demanding um, that I've ever done and I've done like almost exclu exclusively uh, action films minus like Pitch Perfect. So I was like, I got this. The action stuff, that'll be easy. And it wasn't at all. It's like quite difficult. And it's like a lot in a row. Because in films, you can do three days to do uh, actions. And it's like TV, it's like much faster. The suit adds a different level to that. Wires add a different work, uh, level to that. Um, and then I'm emotionally exhausted from some of the character stuff that we're doing that's really like heartfelt. And so by the end of it, I, I'm like eating every two hours because I'm like, I'm burning so many calories and I'm going straight to bed and I'm getting straight back up and doing it all again and just like living this character and that's it's like I've never been able to do because I've never been the lead so I've never been instead of every scene every day uh, and playing like two characters because your Kate Kane and Batwoman is is different as well and it just as an actor and as a human a very rewarding experience well for us as well and we're so excited for this show and it's, we're so excited for everything and that you're in this role too so Want more extra? Hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.